this van is only ever played sporadically. We do one gig here, one gig there, and we all go off and do our other tours and gigs. But this is the first time we've done like 12 gigs, 13 gigs, what is it, in a row, bang, 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 in the space of a month. And I'm just blown away by that, the way the band is you know, coming together with, as a sound. And um, just to hear everybody like get inside the music. It's instrumental music, which is really interesting because uh, we can we all draw from it so differently. But to me, it, uh, I think about Australia. I think about travelling through the outback, kind of into regional places. I think about what Matt's experience must have been like in Ethiopia, and just that we are so fortunate to live in this kind of cultural melting pot. And as well as the cultural melting pot that we live in, we live in within such a melting pot of musicians, and it feels just great to be a part of that. Community. I'm really glad that this band has kept on going for so long, even though sometimes I've been disappointed that we haven't played more often. It's just been nice to see the development of, of all the music, and I guess it's also given me a good reference for myself as a player as well. I only recently joined the Mr. Ott Collective, Super Collective. I've actually been an avid fan of this band for many years. absolutely inspired by African rhythms and jazz music. It's the big question, it's like what is our musical identity here in, in Little Old Sydney? You know? When I'm thinking about Highway 1, it feels like being on the road and getting somewhere and it feels about like the vastness of Australia and the outback and the landscape. There's this rhythm, this da 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 and it feels like it repeats and it, it almost feels like this, the tradition of like the train song. I'm so inspired at the moment to uh, to write the next album, and I wasn't uh, before the tour. I was just like, oh, I'm gonna make all these other things. But it's like we have to build on what we've just um, created. How can you describe how you envisage the next album sounding? Yeah, I, I'm not there yet, Benny. I'm, I'm not. I'm, I'm gonna have to get back to you on that because I need to go into the studio and uh, investigate. <laughs>